Hi everybody, let's learn how to play Alien Equation. So first we're going to start in beginner mode, so I'm going to click on beginner. And here you can see the board. Uh, to play the game, you want to move tiles left, right, up, or down. So I'm going to click on this 4 here, and I'm going to slide it up, and then I'm going to slide it down. You can also click on it again and slide it left or right. Now if you'll notice, watch this equal sign. When I slide to the right, it's going to wrap around to the other side after it goes off the edge. It's going to happen vertically also. So let's make an equation. Let's do uh, 4 plus 1 equals 5. So I already have a 4 plus here, so I'm just going to slide this to the right. I'm going to move this 1 down. I'm going to move an equal sign into place. And I'm going to move a 5 over here. And that's really all there is to it. Another thing we can do is uh, equations will ver work vertically. Let's go with this 6 plus 5 here, and let's find an 11. So I'm actually going to put two 1s on top of each other. Once we use all these addition signs, we'll proceed to the next level. So let's do one more equation. 1 plus 2 equals 3. Now I'm really excited to show you practice mode. This is great for kids that want to practice their math skills. So if you go to New Game and Practice, you're presented with this board where you can select which operators you'd like to work with, the size of the grid, and so let's say, uh, let's just work with subtraction for right now and let's do a 6x6 six six grid. This would be for little kids that want to learn subtraction. So you click Next and you can uh, select which bug you want on the board. If they're really young, then you can just turn them both off. And this will let you practice your skills indefinitely. So uh, let's play a little bit. 7 minus 1 equals 6. Another thing you can do is generate negative numbers. So maybe 2 minus 6 equals negative 4. So I'm going to stick my 2 minus 6 here, and I'm going to put an equal sign, and I'm going to put a minus sign, and then I'm going to put a 4. And uh, again, this is going to work vertically as well. 2 minus 6 equals negative 4. Now, practice mode can get as complicated as any other mode in the game. Let's try a practice mode. Or maybe we just want to work on our division, but we want it to be a little tougher. So let's do a 8x8 uh, eight eight grid, and let's turn on the parasite and the sticky flu. Now this is a lot more difficult, so uh, let's make some equations. Remember, you always want the bigger number on the left if you want to create solid equations. So uh, five, 15 divided by 3 equals 5. Let's try one other fancy equation. Let's do 4 divided, let's do 4 divided by 8 equals 1 divided by 2. This is basically a, a fractional, or reducing a fraction. So now we're in expert mode, and we've got a, a special tile on the board. We actually have two of them. These are called the sticky flu. And the sticky flu attacks tiles and sticks them together. And the way to interact with these is uh, if it's a horizontal, it can only move left, right. If it's vertical, it can only move up or down. And if you try to move any tiles around it, they'll also only move in that direction, up or down. You cannot move these left or right. And the way to get rid of them is to solve that equation. So 2 times 81 is going to be 162. So let's go find those numbers. 1, 6, 2. And there you go. You freed it. Now this is called a parasite tile. And this tile will uh, eventually grow into a monster inside and kill you if you don't destroy it before the time runs out. So as you can see, it's pulsing. Uh, let's get rid of this guy. So I'm going to do 8 divided by 2 equals 4. So let's find a 4 that we can get to. And there we go. We've destroyed the parasite. Okay, now let's talk about vaccine tiles. This is a special equal sign that will kill all the bugs on the board when used. The easiest way to get a vaccine is to create an equation with two operators. So uh, maybe let's do six times five, seven times five equals thirty-one plus four, and we got one. Here it is. 
one of the catches with using two operators in one equation is it's only going to get you an equal sign half the time you do it. So uh, be wary of that. Now the other way to get a vaccine tile is to solve two equations at once. So I've already set this up here. We've got 2 plus 8, and these equals are going to move down. It's going to be equals 10, and below it is 7 plus 4 equals 11. So let's move these into place. And voila, we have another vaccine tile. Maybe let's try and use this one too. So 9 times 8 equals 72. Let's find a 2. Here's a 2. Well, thanks for playing Alien Equation. We hope these instructions were helpful. Good luck fighting the space virus, and keep checking back at Funner Labs for more stuff.